Hello, my name is Marco and I want to do this video uh, in response to the Guadalupe Garcia deportation. Uh, and uh, this morning I was on BBC World Radio uh, talking about it. There was uh, an attorney and there was some documented uh, people that uh, gave their opinion on the matter and uh, as I said I, I think there's uh, a lot of people are taking advantage of this and they're exploiting the subject uh, especially uh, the Democrats uh, the uh, activists that are uh, that have an agenda to uh, discredit uh, Donald Trump or Donald Trump supporters in our efforts to uh, make America great again. And I'm doing this video because I'm really, really, really disturbed by what I have been seeing in Univision and other news outlets that are planning and, uh, a, a day without immigrants. Uh, so February 16 is a day without immigrants where uh, there encouraging immigrants to not go to work, uh, to not go to school, uh, immigrants to not eat. Oh no, I think, I think they're going to eat that day, but they're pretty much not gonna do anything. Uh, so, uh, also, uh, they're trying to say that Guadalupe Garcia is the first victim of Donald Trump. And that is just wrong because this deportation was during the Obama administration. It goes back to 2008. I believe this person was convicted in 2013 for a felony, an administrative uh, issue where uh, she was using somebody else's identity. Uh, there's a lot of people on the, uh, on the Trump supporter side that are really pissed because they have been victims of identity theft and it, they have lost a lot and then there's people on the other side that they're saying well it was just uh, we just just uh, not the social and they think it's not a big deal but it's a felony uh, and uh, the law is the law and the application of the law was the uh, the result of that was this deportation and what I want to say to the activists, to your division, and to all these people. Where the hell were you when they deported my uncle, Mateo? Where the hell were you guys at when they deported my cousin Antonio twice in the same month? Why all of a sudden this is a big thing for you guys? Now, I see everybody uh, saying that this is hate that they're not gonna send their kids to school, that pretty much the world is gonna stop for you guys. Well, I don't think that makes a big difference to the country, to be honest with you. That is very destructive. You guys have a really bad attitude. People on the left, my critics are attacking me, saying all these things. You guys have the wrong, wrong, wrong attitude. And in Spanish is called limosneros y con garrote. You guys want to force your way in into a system that has rules. And the law is the only thing that makes us equal in the eyes of this nation. The law tells how fast I can drive. The law says when I have to do my taxes and how much I have to pay for, for taxes. I cannot break the law without expecting any repercussions. So Univision, shame, shame, shame on you to use one of your words. The hate attacks are the ones that you are doing. You are emotionally seducing our communities and you're poisoning their minds with an ideal, with an ideology that will do only harm. Please, como decía mi mamá, recapaciten.
hijos de su mamá. Gracias.